Social media platforms are increasingly becoming democratized by creators, and they're the ones that are persuading consumers on what they want to buy. They're shaping those purchase decisions. Over half of Gen Z in the US says that creators are the reason that they're purchasing new products. So we need to consider how creators are part of your commerce strategy and part of your lower funnel strategy, not just using them for those upper funnel metrics. Hi, I'm Kelsey Chickering. I'm a principal analyst at Forrester. Creators are like the new publishers on brands' media plans because they're going to continue to get more share of time and share of budget as we move into the next several years. Forrester data shows that over half of Gen Z say that social media influencers are the primary way that they discover new products and brands. So they need to respond to this power. And as brands are bringing creators into their marketing plans, it's disrupting these traditional advertising paradigms that we have in place. You know, we used to think about creative agencies of being the primary creative directors for brands, but you have Gymshark. They hired a bodybuilding influencer as their creative director. Pretty Little Thing, they hired a fashion influencer in the same role. And they're also producing content. I talked to, as part of my research, Rainbow Shops, and the primary content that they're using on their social media platforms are from creators because it performs better. As you're trying to find creators that are gonna help you with your lower funnel marketing goals, that starts with finding creators that already buy you, right? So look for the creators who can authentically talk about your brand, talk about why it's great, and put that out to their followers. As creators also think about how to succeed in this world, you know, I tell brands all the time, be choosy about the creators you work with. The same goes inversely. As a creator, be choosy about the brands you work with. Don't work with just anyone. Try to work with brands who you actually love and who can, you can authentically represent and build those deeper relationships over time. Don't do a one and done partnerships. Think about how you can work with them over time because it takes time for them to learn you and you to learn them. Let that happen. One of the biggest growth areas that we're seeing in the creator economy is affiliate marketing. And when we talk to marketers, over half who are working with creators already actually say that driving direct sales is the reason they're doing it. So more and more creators are becoming part of your commerce strategy.